is a sign. Tonight, there will be a red moon. And we wolves shall all gather for the howling. Oh, will we be allowed to join in this year, Arcala? Yes, Bala. You are big wolves now. It is time that you join the ceremony. What about me? You. You can't come. You're not a proper wolf. Silence, Peona. Mowgli is just as much one of us as you are. Yes, Mowgli. You may come too, but you must practice your howling. Don't worry, I can do it. <laughs> oh, poor Mowgli. Is this the best you can do? You know, if you can't howl, you can't come to the ceremony tonight. I will be at the howling. I just have to practice until I get it right. We'll help you, Mowgli. Good luck. Oh, how easily Mowgli fell for my lie. <laughs> That terrible noise! Don't worry, I'll get it. Of course you will, Mowgli. <laughs> if someone doesn't stop waking me up with that awful noise, they're going to be sorry. <laughs> To this once and for all. There's no good. I'm going home. No, let him go. He'll be all right. Well, I can't see anything wrong with your throat. There must be. Oh, here, try some honey. That's always good for throats. <laughs> That's it. I give up. Ooh. Oh. I'll never get to go to the howling. It's worse than that, Mowgli. If you don't howl properly at the ceremony, you'll be banished from the pack. What? It's true. My advice? Leave the jungle altogether before you're humiliated in front of the whole wolf council. You're right. I'll go. <laughs> My plan worked. Got you! Now, will you stop that awful howling and let me get some sleep? Bala, Lali, have you seen Mowgli? No, we thought he was with you. <laughs> he's run off and I have no idea where he's gone. He was worried about his howling. Don't worry, Baloo. We'll find him. <laughs> Leave me alone, Shere Khan. What? Why aren't you afraid? I'm leaving the jungle forever. There. That should make you happy. Hmm? Well, that's a shame. I enjoy our little chases. Tell you what. How about just one more for old time's sake? <laughs> Away, little man. Oh, yes, I can. <laughs> Beat that car. <laughs> you could do it better. 
better than me, man cub. Shikon! That can only mean one thing. He's found Mowgli! <laughs> Must have lost him. Or maybe not. Thank goodness! It's only you! <laughs> Why did you run away, Mowgli? Iona said that if I couldn't howl, I'd be thrown out of the pack. What? But that's nonsense. No one gets thrown out for not howling. Really? Of course not. Peona was lying to you. Oh. Well, at least I can stay. Oh. Well, well, well. Three for the price of one. This is turning out to be a good day. <laughs> I'm afraid not. <gasps> This is a very old building. The walls crumble so easily. See? Howl oh, for help. They won't hear you from in there. We have to get out. The only way is through the roof. That's too high for us to jump. You have to climb out and call for help, Mowgli. How do you know it's him? I'd know my cubs howl anywhere. Everyone, quick, follow me! Well, it would appear to be lunchtime. Let them go! You're in no position to be giving orders, man cub. Any last requests? Uh, go away and never come back? Quest denied. <laughs> You're outnumbered, Khan. Leave now. <laughs> you are a true wolf, Mowgli. No, I'm not, Arkayla. I couldn't howl like a wolf. I had to use this. But, Mowgli, Howling doesn't make a wolf. Bravery makes a wolf. The important thing is that you saved your brother and sister. You have truly earned your place at the Howling. Well, Mowgli, you made it to the Howling, despite Peona's efforts. Where is Peona anyway? Do you care? <laughs> <laughs>
Let me go, you silly snake! I'm missing the howling! Come on, Mowgli! Faster! <laughs> Really say that? How could anybody think of eating at a time like that? If that was me, I'd have thrown him in the ravine. Ricky's right. It's all my fault. No, it's mine. I swore to protect Mowgli with my life. No, you're both wrong. That tiger is to blame. We've lost a dear friend, and it's all because of Sheer Khan. <laughs> Shikan said, he's dead. Then that must have be be been a ghost. Hey, that sounds like Lolly. Why is she so sad? Brother is right, my dear. Mowgli is dead. What? And we must carry on without him as best we can. Poor things. But they're in for a nice surprise when they see me. <gasps> really? All this weeping and wailing over a human so undignified. Shere Khan, you'll apologize for that remark at once. I told you I'd get rid of the man cub. Now that it's done, just remember who rules this jungle. Chicken! Huh? Help! Uh, oh, 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 there's a ghost! Right behind me! Mowgli's back from the dead! Fool! What are you gibbering about? I saw Mowgli's ghost! He's come back to haunt us! Nonsense! I have got rid of the man cub once and for all, and for that, I shall never apologize. Mowgli's ghost. Just you wait, Shere Khan. By the time my ghost finishes with you, you'll be more than happy to apologize. <laughs> huh? Khan, there's a ghost out there, somewhere. You still insist you've seen this ghost? You're in danger of boring me, Tabaki. Shere Khan, <laughs> it's you who is in danger. Oh, it's him! What was that? Who goes there? You know who I am, Shere Khan. You killed me. Man-cub? 
It can't be. Oh, now do you believe me? I told you I saw his ghost. Oh, please don't hurt me, Ghost of Mowgli. I don't want to die. I don't want to die. Get away from me. I tell you, there are no such things as ghosts. Oh, yes, there are. Now you've upset my friends, Shere Khan. And for that, you must pay. You must tell everyone you're sorry for what you did. Darcy! Mowgli, you're alive! Oh, oh, I can't wait to tell everybody. No, no, don't. I'm not alive. Really? But you look so, so healthy. Shh! No, I'm Mowgli's ghost. Uh, and I'm busy right now, doing some haunting. Oh, I see. I'm sorry to disturb you. Uh, goodbye, Mowgli's ghost. It's obvious Baloo is playing some trick on me. Are you sure? I've heard that once evil spirits get a hold of you, they never let go. Tabaki is right. I will never give up. Not until you apologize to everyone. Where are you? Come out and face me. I'm here. And here. <laughs> I hate that tiger. Baloo, how can you eat anything right now? I always eat when I'm when I'm sad. Oh my! Oh dear! Oh, you wouldn't believe it! Uh, are you all right, Darcy? Oh yes, I think I saw him. I saw Mowgli. You what? Well, not him. Him. I mean, Mowgli's ghost. Not you too, Darcy. Darcy, can you remember where you met this ghost? Oh yes. Sure I can. Take me there. Right now. All right, you win, ghost. But you must promise to leave me in peace. I will. As long as you tell all the animals you're sorry. As you wish. <laughs> well, what are you waiting for? Very well. I shall call them all to the ravine where I, uh, you fell. Why there? It is the most fitting place, is it not? They can gather on the other side of the ravine, while you can be on my side to witness my great humiliation. The ravine? Why the ravine? I don't know. But perhaps he likes the view. He's mocking us. I promise you, he means it. He's on his way there now. Thank you, Tabaki. I shall gather everyone together. Unless ghosts have a scent, Darcy, Mowgli is alive. He was here. We've got to tell Baloo. Come on. Where's Baloo? Didn't you know? He's gone to the ravine to hear Khan's apology. Why didn't you go with them? Too sad. I've gathered you here for a very special reason. I have something important to say to you all. I'm sorry to say that Mowgli isn't dead after all. What? But he soon will be. Uh, oh, it's him! It's the ghost! Don't it again! You fool! It's not a ghost! Stop! Tabaki!
our luck. He survived. <laughs> and thanks to you, Bagheera. So did I this time. Mowgli! <laughs> I should have told you what I was up to. I'm sorry, Baloo. We're all just pleased you're still alive. Mowgli! Lolly! Oh, <laughs> <laughs>